Right, developing tonight, places of worship in Marion County now able to operate at 50% capacity after spending a couple of weeks limited to just a couple dozen people. That is a big change as we go into the weekend. So News Ace Travis Robinson found out how some churches are planning to keep you and your family safe. Any place of worship having services this weekend already has some guidelines set in place by the mayor. Wear a mask and socially distance. But some places are taking extra measures to make sure you're safe and comfortable. Caution tape blocked off many of the seats at Southside Reformed Presbyterian Church as they stuck to crowds of 10. Now that tape is coming off as they move toward filling seats this weekend, all assigned by ushers so people are distanced and no seat is used twice in the same day. Yeah, we'll have more people sitting up front maybe than ever, so that'll, that'll work really well. They're also encouraging people to bring their own material. If they use the churches, those books will be placed in a contamination pile for two weeks. But before you even get in the door, the church is assigning people to a specific service to make sure everyone can make it to whatever fits their schedule. We won't do seat assignments in terms of having a grid of where everybody's sitting ahead of time. It'll be sort of a first come, first serve. The first people in will end up in the front rows and, you know, we'll seat toward the back. Elevation Church of India is doing something similar. They're having people reserve spots for a service so they don't go over their self-imposed 50-person limit. A week out, they can reserve their, whichever service they want. And, and we're doing more services so that we can accommodate more people and do social distancing. They say they set a limit because they want to properly social distance. By keeping their limit low, they say they can reassure the congregation they're coming to a health-conscious, safe facility. It's a whole new world, and so <laughs> we're cleaning and sanitizing stuff in between and uh, trying to do the things we can. We want people to be safe and healthy, and uh, so in, in we're doing what we can to cover that. Both of the churches I spoke to today say that they're going to continue doing digital services. That way, if you don't feel comfortable going or you just can't make it, you won't miss out. I'm Travis Robinson, Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook.